Hi, I'm here with Chantal Michel from the Halton Environmental Network to discuss her Graciously Green campaign. Now, you were here last week and you were able to touch a little bit of base about that. Can you please recap that for our viewers? For sure. So, the Halton Environmental Network has created easy tips for anyone to follow so that they can stay low impact while still being generous this holiday season. So, we have this guide on our Facebook page as well as our website. All you have to do is look for the Graciously Green campaign and you can follow these easy tips. That's great. So let's go over it. Let's dive right in. What's the first one? The first one is to go natural, which is really easy. So instead of opting for plastic decorations, a plastic tree, um, look for more uh, natural options. So we okay. can go outside with the family and gather some branches and pine cones and things that you can decorate, throw in a vase, tie a ribbon around it, and you have a beautiful centerpiece. So really easy ways to bring nature indoors while getting rid of those plastic materials. Well, yeah, I was outside for a walk the other day with my daughter. We got some acorns and they're in a bowl now and the smell is very aromatic. Of course, it, it yeah. It gives it a nice touch, definitely. And uh, what's what about Christmas trees uh, that people can't bring into buildings if you live in an apartment? There are some rules against that. What can people do that can't take advantage? Yeah, well, you can be creative. Um, I have a small potted tree that I was using as a Christmas tree, so it doesn't necessarily have to be a huge, grand Christmas tree, but you know, you can be creative and have a small pot, uh, potted one. I've even seen um, two ladders put up together that had lights around it, which was really creative. So there's lots of really great ideas out there if you can't have a tree. Of course, the experience of very of with your course. family is, is probably the most low impact. Exactly, thing you can do this holiday season. And number two, what would that, that be? Yeah, so uh, one of the things that I hate the most is food waste, and especially when we have lots of family coming over. You have your holiday work parties. They always want to have a lot of food for the people that are there. But if people don't eat it all, it usually gets thrown out. So come prepared. Bring your own containers. Invite your guests to bring containers or have your own, so that you can pack up the leftovers and make sure that someone eats it when they get home. And if you're not a fan of plastic Tupperwares, feel no shame. <laughs> Bringing a glass one, you can keep reusing it, you and your whole family, and it, it lasts all year round. That's of a course. really great low impact thing to use, and freezing food, of course, if For sure. instead of throwing it out or passing it over to your neighbors, yeah. right? So the facts in Halton is that about 50% of our food gets thrown out, so it's really great for us to help minimize that and the holiday season is a great place to start. That's great. And what's the hashtag you're using this season? Yeah, so if you've done something graciously green, you can use the hashtag graciously green and share us uh, sorry, share your low impact gift ideas this year. That's great. Thanks for coming in Chantal. Thanks for having me.